Neil, proud to be from Wakefield and a particularly proud day for you today getting this Wakefield star on stage. You must be delighted. Yeah, I'm very honoured. I, I got the theme of the city last year and I think that was, a, you know, that topped all the trophies that I'd got and the awards that I've won. Uh, and to have a star, you know, really uh, of Wakefield, it, it's, it's amazing. Uh, and I'd like to thank all the people of Wakefield for voting first to be nominated, then uh, being accepted. That's a great idea by the council to, to recognise people that have done so much and put the city on the map, isn't it? Yes. Uh, and I said everything seems to have come this last two or three years with me. You know, I, we've just had a, a housing estate named after me. I've already got a bus and a street in Wakefield and now a start of Wakefield, it's, it's amazing and I'm really proud, you know, not just for myself but for the family. Fantastic honour for Neil, uh, well deserved, I think it's a great idea that Wakefield celebrate the, uh, the success of people who were born in the city and led a, a good life in their chosen profession and are still doing a great work today and I think Neil He's a, he's a regular down at the club, he supports everything we do recently, he supported the Club 1873 launch and, and agreed to be president of that, so we, we're, we're certainly grateful for his continued work, but I think it's really good of the, the, the council and the people of Wakefield to recognise that and vote Neil in and Jane as well for uh, the work that they've done and, and, and everyone can remember it then and everyone can see it. Obviously Jane uh, opened our Community Trust when we launched it uh, and she was very good on that day and again she she's, uh, she's asked questions today on how it's going and, and what's going on with it so it's good that people, however famous they are and however successful they are, they remember where their roots are. Well, I'm absolutely thrilled of course, you know, being from Wakefield, like I said, we're all very proud of Wakefield, you know, with the wild cats with us and everything, you know, we've got some great things in Wakefield and we do support it very, very much so to be honoured with the star, um, it's like Hollywood. <laughs> Hollywood with rain. So, yeah, it's brilliant. Very proud moment. Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm sure that uh, it does rub off onto the younger people, you know, that what I've done, it can happen to them as well. But a lot of hard work's got to go into it and, uh, you know, uh, helping people. And that's the main thing. Success is a, a funny thing. And I always say, even if you tidy your knicker drawer out, that's a success for that day. Um, and it, you can do anything you want. You really, really can. I come from a very working class background, but I've had to work for it. And I think if you're very focused in what you want to do, you can do it. So the trust is a wonderful thing and we, we do encourage the youngsters and, uh, and we will continue to do that. We should be very proud of Wakefield. It's got a wonderful community and I think that's the secret to Wakefield is that we do care about each other here and we, you know, we, we open our arms and say welcome in. And we've got a lot going for it, you know, so um, proud girl, proud girl today. Uh, something else you've also been nominated for the people are voting for at the moment is the, the statue outside Wembley. Um, that was really another great honour when you heard that you've been nominated for that with a, a whole list of rugby league greats. Yes, uh, even to be in the, the ten who's been nominated, uh, I do feel very proud. Uh, I think the voting goes on till uh, end of December. So uh, any way for supporter wants to vote, I'd, I'd, I'd be delighted to have them on my list.